So this question is a diagram question. We have what looks like a right triangle, although the angle D isn't, isn't indicated to be 90 degrees. Um, so let's read the question and see what's going on here. So the question says, which of the following additional pieces of information provides enough information to prove whether triangle DEF is a right triangle? Okay. Well, what I was going to say initially is if DEF were a right triangle, then this side DF would have to be 4. And this comes from our special right triangle, the 3, 4, 5 right triangle, which, of course, we could also have figured out by using Pythagorean theorem, which is provided to you in your references, your math reference page, where a squared plus b squared equals c squared. And of course, a and b are the legs of the right triangle, and c is the hypotenuse. So we could have used that as well to figure out that this was 4. But that only that's only 4 if angle D is a right triangle or is a right, a right angle. So choice 1 says the measure of angle D. Um, so yeah, if we knew the measure of angle D was 90, then yeah, we can, we'd say for sure it's a right triangle. And if we knew it was something other than 90, we would say for sure it's not a right triangle. So I like that answer. Um, and then so that makes D gone because it says neither 1 or 2. Choice 2 the length of segment DF. I like that as well, right? Because if DF is four, then we do know that this is a right triangle. And if it's anything other than four, then we also know that it's not a right triangle. So I like choice C, either one or two. Either one of those bits of information would allow us to prove that triangle DEF is in fact a right triangle.